Maybe, maybe I'll give you the best nut ever. Let's go, Janu. All right, what's up, you guys? <clears throat> Welcome back. Um, Reclusive Whim, thanks for the two-month prime sub, dude. All right, dude. So, uh, match number two, back-to-back, -back, dude. Let me just close some stuff here, I guess. Um. So, obviously, we're going against uh, Bushy and Josh. So, this is going to be... I don't really think there's any easy games, dude. <laughs> like, just even based on just watching the other games so far. I haven't, I haven't fully watched them, but there's really not going to be any uh, simple games. So... Now it's postponed even more with Bingo. It, what's postponed? Let's go, Matt. Yeah, I... I, I I didn't see it, but I heard that there was a, already a rule infraction that happened or something, which, you know, seemed to basically end the game nearly. But, um, but yeah, I, I watched the matches a little bit more today. Like, there's definitely, there's a lot of mistakes that people are making, dude. And it's not, it's not even just strategic. It's, it's literally just like dying to bosses and... This kind of stuff, so... Again, that's probably where I think we have the advantage. How's it going, Jello? Well, I, I don't know if it's a rule issue. It's just... I, I What I heard is that Kazoo just marked a square for, like, the wrong one for too long. Because I, I did that last game. Like, my mouse slipped, and I... I just... I hit the wrong button as I was panicked trying to mark it. And... Or, I didn't hit the wrong button. I just clicked the wrong square. And, uh... Luckily, I unmarked it immediately, but... The, the reason for that rule and, and the way, like, it actually makes a lot of sense, right? So let's say two people are going to a square. Let's say, like, Lanciax, all right? So you're, you're, one person kills Lanciax a little bit before. Um, or, or let's just say someone, someone, like, marks the wrong square and someone else is going for Lanciax, right? They look over. They see that Lanciax is marked as they're fighting. And then they immediately quit out. And next thing you know, like, oh, they unmarked the square and you just waste all that time. So, like, it actually makes sense. It, it actually, like, that's why it's like that. It seems really fast, but honestly, like, that's probably a good rule. Uh, because, yeah, like, if, if it gets marked and then it doesn't immediately get unmarked and you quit out of a fight, then, like, you, you're toast. So, so yeah, it, it actually does make sense, but it, it is unfortunate that, like, it's going to happen. People are going to miss mark. And, uh, yeah. Also, I don't know if you guys noticed, but last game, I, I was using live split for the, the, like, no, or the, the no logo mod. And it just didn't work. Like, I think, I, I think it's because I, I started live split before the game and it wasn't, like, hooked in or whatever, so. And, and so what I did, I had to, like, panic open up ER tool so that it would just work. But I, I don't really want to use ER tool because, um... I don't want to act like I have so, I have muscle memory from practicing skips and stuff. I have so much muscle memory of of teleporting, like control V. And I like I don't accidentally do that in a match, dude. Like I guess I guess if that happened, you would just quit out, like fast travel back to your last grace and continue or something. But maybe I should maybe I should just like remove those. Oh yeah, when when the game starts, I'll check. Maybe I can just disable them. Um. Good games, guys. I like everyone is. All right, bye bye. It sounds like they're done, so we simply wait. Probably go in like ten minutes or so. Uh, we'll continue it. Uh, unsoppable. I said that totally wrong, but 
Yeah, we'll continue it. No, I, I didn't really watch both matches fully. Um, I did see the end of this one where <laughs> people were going for Millennia. And, what, like, it's so tough in bingo. Because I think a lot of people are used to fighting her. You got, like, Flame Grammy Strength. You got Golden Vow. You have all your talismans, like Ritual Sword, Axe Talisman, um, like, Source Seal. And your damage is, like, considerably higher. And so going into that fight where it doesn't just end in two minutes is not... Again, and you also... That's a fight where um, you need to know how it works with every weapon class, which is why... Well, it's part of the reason why I was doing that the other day. Like trying to optimize the weapon classes on that fight. Because I know how to fight the boss with any weapon, basically, but... You know, fighting her optimally is totally different, right? Like, the difference uh, on Millennia, I think it's more so than any other boss, where the difference between an optimal fight and a suboptimal fight could literally be, like, 60% difference, you know? Like, if you're going for all the right punishes, then that fight is considerably faster. But but also, it's not really something... I love the sponsor they <laughs> they have for the League, dude. It's so funny, dude. Root Intellect. Any plant. It's so good, dude. It's nice that they got a sponsor for this. I mean, probably better than like Raid Shadow Legends or something, if we're being honest. Um, what was I saying? I can't remember. I don't know. How would I fight Millennium with Dark Moon? Dark Moon Straight Sword. What is that? And the Great Sword? It's the same as any other. Um, Great sword fight, R1, R1 combos, and then you just use that tap R2 or fully charge R2 just whenever you can. I go just destroyer. But yeah, all the matches were. I, I think the first match of today seemed like it was closer, like relatively close. And, and I think. Um, like, it could have gone either way, really, just based on the choices that uh, people made in the match. Like, I think, based on what I saw on the board and what I heard people saying was, like, had Chris gone underground initially to get the Mimic tier plus set up the, like, Finger Slayer, then probably would have won. But then, you know, he decided to do something else, and then Huppery went down, so... Yeah, it's important to be able to see stuff like that, dude. Like, see the locations of things, especially when it's... There's not really much of that this season anymore where, like, like in the first season, it was all about Altus access, right? You had to identify how much stuff was there, and then if there was a lot, you had to access it. And it's the same with Underground. Um, and, like, this season, again, doesn't have that much of that, but that Underground area after Redan is an example of it, I think. Where there could be a lot down there, and if there is, then you want to unlock it. Although, I guess the, the Ancestor Spirit is not really a post Redan play anymore, right? In season one, it used to be where if if he was there, you were assuming you were killing Redan and then you would go down. Surely edit all these in a week? <laughs> yeah, surely, dude. It is an interesting choice going both weekend days, dude. It's it like... Or, or back to back. Wait, do I have season two in the title? Oh, shit, dude. Whoops. It's funny. I have it, I have it correct in the YouTube title, but not the Twitch title. Wait, and also... Oh, I, dude, I changed the wrong number is what happened. <laughs> I, I changed the... Whoops. I changed the one from a two instead of the... Anyways. Um, but yeah, I, I don't know. Like, As we play more matches, I'll get a better gauge of how, how I'm feeling about all this. But I think our first match was decent. Darfist is quite fast on, on Millennia. Darfist is definitely good. I like, you know what? I like the Spike Cestus a lot on her too. Because the, the punches, like the tap R2 can be chained. Like you can, if, if Millennia stuns from a tap R2, you can just keep doing it over and over and over again. 
Like, so you could potentially get like five tap R2s in a row on Millennia with the, with the punch. 15 minute plus nine. I mean, it, yeah, probably not going to do that. But if Millennia is center square, like the, the problem is, I don't think anybody else in the league would go for an early Millennia. So, so therefore, it makes no sense for me to do it, right? Unless, unless there's some huge strategic play, right? But, but yeah, like usually I feel like it'd just be a waste of time. Yeah, maybe Tom, I guess, but they didn't do it in this match. But also it wasn't a very good square, so. But, but the, the way I could see it working out, like let's say Millennia is a center square. And so you rush, get, you know, whatever weapon. Like, if you have, if you have something like Claws or, like, the Spike Cestus or Starfist, you could theoretically go in there with lower upgrades. Like, say, plus 16 or plus 12 even, maybe. Um, but, yeah, so let's say she was center square, and you, you go get a plus 9. You do her, and then you get the center square, but then let's say there's like two stat dumps, or maybe three. Let's say there's rune level 60 plus 30 arcane plus 30 faith or something. You could theoretically get a four and one square almost, right? Or maybe even more, I'm not sure. You could get a hitless millennia with claws. Like, if you think about it, there are, I guess, like six squares you could get almost instantly. But you have blood... Let's say you have, like the, you have some sort of claw. There's... Hitless claw, like you wouldn't get it first anyways. That was the problem. But um, I definitely get more stress during bingo than probably anything I've done before in regards to like streaming. I think. I think the the reason, like even in zero hit league, I didn't, but I didn't because I I think it's it's slower paced. It's just like a no hit thing, and speed doesn't really matter. But this, the, like for bingo, it's just. Go, go, go constantly. Like, it's all about speed, so. I have to be a lot more alert. Well, yeah, yesterday, yesterday was a pretty comfortable match, to be honest. So, like, when things get close, it'll be, <laughs> you know, like, it'll be, yeah. Yeah, speed stuff is definitely more stressful, yeah. Yeah, green screen's bright today. I, I don't have my lights on just because they're kind of annoying, so. Yeah, based on how the matches are going so far, I, I really, the, it, it honestly gives me no indication of how I think the playoffs, like who the top, is it top three or four? I don't know, but I, I genu like genuinely have no idea who's going to make it in the top. Okay, top three, and then I guess the first place gets a buy or something. Uh, but yeah, I have no idea. Because, I mean, my initial thought was that for sure, um, Pattery was going to make it, which I still think is probably true, but they have to clean up some stuff. Like, e even in the match today, based on the small bits that I, I saw, like, there's a lot of mistakes that were made. And I think, you know, I think Aggie's team's good. Like, the, I, I, I have no idea. Well, a buy is basically meaning that you skip around. So, so I, I guess it would be the top three, place two and three, have a match to determine who goes to the final, and then one automatically goes to the final. So, let's go and recycle. Thanks for good luck, dude. Uh, next video coming out, I'm honestly not sure because we don't we don't have many uh, like runs in the backlog. But I think it'll be bingo. We might have some more bingo match videos. So, but yeah, it's gonna be interesting, dude. And and the and the season goes by very quick. So, it's gonna happen very fast. Are are they do they actually start on time? Like is it actually gonna be ten minutes away here?
Birthplace doesn't play further. Well, there's that, there's most likely going to be some ties, yeah. I would assume. So there's going to be a tiebreaker, which, like, usually tiebreakers work where it's like you take head to head. Like, that should be the first tiebreaker. So if you beat the team that you're tied with, then you should move on. And then beyond that, like, it's kind of tough. I, I was thinking, I was actually thinking you could do something based on how long the matches last. So, in, so for example, in your wins, if you win quickly, that means you were had a more dominant performance, like sort of, I guess. But not really, though, because some boards are just faster. So I don't know, man. It's, it's kind of tough past that point to determine what a good tiebreaker would be. But like if you, you would think if you, lose, if you lose fast, then you got smoked. And if you win fast, you dominated. And in the case that a match goes long, that means it was closer, right? Like basically every time. So you could have something with that. I don't think I don't think you could just do you can't do squares, obviously. Because, you know, you could do bingos, I I guess, right? Bingo could be a tiebreaker. Which makes sense. Yeah, yeah, square difference, actually. That makes way more sense, you're right. Or, or po not square difference, point difference. Yeah, that'd make way more sense. Yeah, like if you, yeah, that, I mean, I don't know why I thought of time initially, but yeah, that, that makes way more sense. So maybe you could do, um, I mean, you could, you could even do point differential first, right? Because maybe you just had an off match against somebody who you're in a tiebreaker against, depending on how you wanted to do it. So, yeah, I, I, I think, yeah, point differential could be a good stat. Bingos could be decent. I, I think I like point differential more. Just because in, in some boards, like, it doesn't make sense to go for bingo, so. I think point differential is, is more in, indicative of, like, a dominant performance against somebody. All right, I, I should probably check. Okay, we got the seed. Guess I'm just gonna use I, I'm just gonna use ER tool today. I don't I don't trust live split at this point for the no logo. Well, like I think I just need to start live split after I start the game. Oh, shit, they also give us the room and stuff. I totally missed that. We are red team today. <clears throat> um, I have to join the board on both my PCs so that I can... Like, I, I don't even know if they're using the map thing. Because like, the, the, there's, like, a map that... I, I, if people watch Season 2, they know what I'm talking about. It, like, it hooks into the game, so I need to run on my game PC. But I, I don't think there's really room this season for that because there's just... There's so much already going on. Oh, have they shown it on stream? But I, I just think in this season, it doesn't really make as much sense because we can just warp anywhere. So, not sure uh, it makes sense. It could definitely make, it makes sense a lot in, in season two, though, because it's like a proper start to the match. The only, the only difference in season two was the randomizers. It was basically the same in every other way. A season one, I mean. You know, it's so it's so interesting, like with the middle squares and stuff, because I I need to get in my head a list of center squares that I want to rush. Okay, I guess I really I want to test. Okay, I'm gonna go with live split again, just so I don't warp myself. But I kind of want to test that I can quit out first. I guess. I can probably just open the game and test a quit out. Hopefully that's not against the rules. On some like 
separate character. I won't look at the starting class, obviously. Okay, so... This. It's going to continue. Not going to check anything. Just want to make sure... Okay, that was good. Okay, so now we are tool needed here. Well, all of both of the games. Yeah, I didn't watch all of them, but I remember seeing both boards and being like, "Woof." I prefer the late game boards, personally. I think like, I do, too. I'm already scatterbrained enough at the beginning of a match. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I think I agree with that. Hi, Gino. Hey. Uh, Yo, Gino. Okay, so Gino joins. So that means you guys can join now. All right. Woohoo! All right, I'm going to close chat now, you guys, so. Hey, so if you guys are joined in, I think all I need to do is confirm Gino has the same starting class as the oh. other three, and then we should be good to go. Okay, sure, one sec. What if we just, like, hung out and chatted yeah, for what, a while Can we instead? make more <laughs> or something instead? Like, I have, I, I can make a bonfire and we could just chill. That yeah. sounds more enjoyable. It's like 60 degrees outside right now. I don't like marshmallows, so you're not winning any favors here. I will so. buy you hot dogs. Not a big hot dog guy. I will buy you a massive guy. jar of pickles and you can eat it on the side while we have our, our marshmallows. You know, you can buy me cotton candy. I feel like that'd be great. Sure. That sounds yeah, great. That's, that's basically a marshmallow, just colored differently. <laughs> Wispy. Yeah. Okay. We're good to go. We got matching classes. Is everybody oh, okay. ready? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Good yeah, luck, I was just guys. saying bye to chat. Good luck. Good luck, right. guys. Take care. Good luck. How am I? <laughs> Why are you laughing? Because uh, Josh was like, he was about to say something and then he got moved. Oh. <laughs> okay, uh, this is a Nobles S stock. Yes, it is. With high vigor. Oh, I didn't look at it yet. Because oh, sorry. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, it's just the first one. It's also so. that that one shield that does something at low health. Yeah, it but gives you. I don't think you... there's parry on it. No. Okay. All right. Four NPC invaders, you know. <sighs> do you want to? Oh my do god! It, look or... at this board. Oh, this is a late game board. Okay. Uh, there is Millennia and Rune level sixty in the same column. Is there any other um, stat dump? Uh, there is no other stat dump. This is a very late game board. Uh, Remembrance, Incant only, so I would check Incants. Holy balls. Okay, huge capital um, because of Morgoth, <clears throat> Morgoth, Shackles, and Moog. Um, there's a Flamberge starting. This is an incredibly disjointed, but oh my god, there's so much killing on this board. There's we a Spiked a Club also. We need Dwyhander, a weapon. that's wieldable. Um, Radon is super important uh, because of bell bearings and mimic tier consumables only. This is going to push us. There's talismans on the board, so we could start with a talisman. Every, everybody stop. Josh crashed. Everybody stop. Oh, okay. We're stopping. Okay, everybody stop. Don't look at the board anymore. <laughs> but I know Classic the board, crash. so can we, keep, can we keep talking? Because, like, I know the... Oh, I can't look at the board. I'm going to cheat. Okay. Um... This is a killing board. I, I'm not looking at the board anymore. But it's a killing board, Gino. Okay, so there... what, So what are we getting? Like a finding a good weapon and then... I think finding a good weapon... There is a lot of collection though, right? Like, Well, I'm not looking at the board anymore, so I well, can't Well, I'm not tell either, but I remember but Physic Flask there's... were on there. Yes, or, and... Talismans. Um... I'm not sure if that plays in our favor at all, but... We know yeah. what we're well, doing, I think. I think it was, well, there's not too much collection. There's Physic Flask, Talismans, and the Bell Bearings. I don't remember there being too many other things. There's a lot of, like, tree bosses. So there's tree bosses, tree sentinel duel. Those, there was Kaled bosses. Um, I think there might have been Limgrave bosses or Altus bosses. Like, um, multiple categories of, of different bosses. So getting built and then starting to kill, I think, is pretty important. Yeah, the real question is just what weapon. Like, there's a, oh, yeah. there's a longsword starting class. Because oh, I can't look at my classes because that's cheating. Did they re-roll the board? 
They might have. I kind of hope not. Oh, but... I liked that board. No, I, I don't know if I liked it. It's okay. There was Millennia and Rune Level 60 and stuff on it, though. But In it's the okay. same column. Yeah. Oh, man. That was a cool board. because there was. Are like we getting a chemical... new randomizer seed, too? I don't know. I don't know what's happening. Oh, his OBS. Oh, it wasn't his game. It was his OBS oh, that crashed. Oh, his stream crashed. Oh, that's like extra bad. Yeah, okay. that's actually really bad. New board. Okay, that's fine. That was a wild board. <laughs> it was crazy. Uh, yeah, it would have been a good test, actually. <laughs> it would have been a good test. Because, it was a yeah. crazy board. <laughs> yeah, so unfortunately, we are going to reset the board. I'm just yeah. going to leave you guys in the channel and just, yeah, keep an eye on the timer. Okay. okay. We're, oh, we're keeping the seed, though. We are keeping the seed. We are not keeping the board. Okay, okay. sounds good. <laughs> That's funny. Man, I was like getting stoked mm -hmm. for that board. That was a that was a get chunky and kill things board. Yeah. But um, we'll probably we're we're probably gonna get an early game board. Like yeah, imagine else now it's today. like Scion plus zero yeah, that's deal. What it's going, that's exactly what it's going to be. Caves, NPCs. Yeah. Margaret. Perry's Godric, Nefeli, Godric's Great Rune, Radon. Just waiting for it. Damn. Has Josh gotten his? Well, I guess we don't know. I wonder I, if his stream's back up. Yeah, I don't know. Please give me the go ahead whenever it lands. Because yeah, hopefully, okay. like, hopefully it's not as like internet shitting itself, or I don't know. Yeah, that would really suck. I really, I would really not. Oh. Timer started. Oh, match starting. Okay. Okay. Match starts now. Horse bosses in center. Tree bosses right below that. Uh, Physic flask tiers. Nefeli. Somber nine bottom left. Uh, Nefeli top right. BBK bottom Oof. right. Friendly NPCs. Trio Sentinel. Wow, this is a crazy board. Yeah, this is kind of what I was thinking. This is getting. like literally what yeah, really I was quick. not hoping for. No, I, I think that's good. Um, okay. So, what do we want to do with dividing this up here? One person needs an upgraded weapon so that they can start killing like Garonk and Blackblade Kindred and mm -hmm. Lanciax, I guess. Yeah, I would say someone Both would Godfrey. pursue the Tree Sentinel plus zero kill and then maybe go for the plus nine while someone else goes for... I mean, there's not another really compelling reason to go for um, Godric while su summoning Nefeli Lu. But it is a top right corner. Um, I mean, is it that powerful though? It's kind of good. And then there's a remembrance weapon on that same line. But there's so yeah. many other early things. Hmm. Um, Maybe... In terms of weapons, there's sacrificial axe, which isn't bad. Um, and then the other option, there is a flame bridge, but we're short three stats. Hmm. And there's a spiked club. Oh, I do like Perry the spike shield. club. Oh, I do like the spike club. Which has okay vigor. Oh, it's but... Vihander. Yeah. And Noble Slender Sword. Doesn't that have square off on it? Uh, wait. Where do you see that? Prisoner. It's Vihander and Noble Slender Sword. Uh, I don't think it does, actually, but... Uh, I can look it up. I'll do it. Okay. I feel like I feel it like does. I it doesn't. Uh, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong. Uh, it does have square off, actually, yeah. Okay, so I would use that for a tree Apparently. sentinel. Um, I think. Oh, okay. Because I think that's going to be the best. Either that or Spikes Club. I don't know what would be better, honestly. I think square off would be a little bit better. But one of us, I think, has to push tree sentinel plus zero and then maybe friendly NPCs after that. Or could even go with horse bosses. Ugh, this is really tough. Okay, so... um. I guess I'll go for Tree Sentinel if it's the okay, right play. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Um, do you want to go can... for NPCs or? Yep, I can go for NPCs. I'll use or do we want to get upgraded and not try to fall behind? I think getting some of these early game squares is important. Do we need Stone Sword keys for any reason? Well, Somber Paintings. plus nine. Okay. And and what about Catacomb too? Like. We really need to just pick which early game. Which line do we like better? We'll look at it as we're going. That line is really crazy. Uh, both of them are pretty nasty. Um, like row five and column two. Um, hmm. 
Bottom left to top of, right diagonal. I, bottom left. Bottom left to top right. Something. Yeah, I do like that. I kind of like the friendly NPCs into that. Like, I kind of like you doing Tree Sentinel into plus nine, and I do friendly NPCs into Godric Nefeli. What do you think? Oh, so, God, Tree I'm Sentinel so heavy. plus Shoot. nine. And leave Catacombs. Yeah, Catacombs isn't that good. Well, it's, I mean, it actually isn't that I don't, bad, that, but... That line isn't that crazy. Although, the row three is kind of... There's Arcane as well, and a stat dump. Yeah. I missed that initially. Alright, so I guess I'm not going to pick up the Grace here. I'm going to go for NPCs. Is that okay? Yep, that's fine. And then I'm going to do that into, um... I think Godric Nefeli Lu. I think. No, I like NPCs because it coordinates us on that bottom row. Yeah, I agree. But I, I have a feeling one of them's probably just going to go for plus nine. They also might not even contest this tree sentinel. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't be surprised. Like one, I do think one they're going to contest. Have... I do think they're going to contest friendly NPCs. Yeah, I yeah I agree. So I'm sorry if I do a bad job. That's okay. So, I'm okay, gonna just do think Vari, about where you're going to pin it Irina. off of if they get it. There's no Hyetta, so... Give me Dragon Halberd. Vari's dead. That was a really good Vari. Bad tree sentinel here, actually. Okay, that's all right. They must not have contested it if they didn't beat me to that. No, that was pretty fast, you know. No, that, that, was, three, like, that was For brutal. square off, it was slow. I will say this. For square off, it was a slower fight, but it was still Yeah, I whiffed, like, I whiffed two square offs, I think. GG's. What did you get for the weapon? You have a tree boss. It was Loretta boss. Sickle. Okay. Which is a terrible weapon. Yeah. So you have one of each of those, okay? Oh my god, my menuing today. Okay, I'm going Bach, and then I'm going to do Irina, I think. Yep, that's correct. All right, I got the runes from him. He only gives a hundred runes. That's so sad. Loretta's is a somber weapon, though, but it. Okay, there's going to be something better. Yeah. Surely. Oh god, I'm struggling to find the... Okay. Alright. They serve but you. I can play turning to aid you. You need O to the... Do you think I should just square off, Irina? Ah, I uh, you can do like an R2 and then roll or something, or an uppercut and then roll the AoE. Okay. Does she always do the AoE? Yes, yeah, I think every time you hit her, she does it. Okay. Oops, I missed the last one. It's okay. I'm fairly certain they're going to be going for okay. something. Like, I, I think probably... Um... 
One I of them I probably went for Somber 9 right away, so I'm not going to beat him to it, but... I think I just need to quit out here. Okay. Yeah, yeah. There's there's some, somebody aggro's you. I'm not sure who yeah, it is Yeah, the there. little guys on the ground, I think, that are, like, pretending to be dead. Okay. Um, I was thinking of going to... Godric with Nefeli Lu. You have one tree boss and one horse boss. I could also do Raya's right now. Um... But I kind of like... Well, Godric with Nefeli Lu does not do much for us right now. I'm gonna you know what? There's forward. Smithing Stone Bell Bearing into Falling Star Beast. I do see that. Do you know the fast way down to... Uh... Oh, Smithing Stone Belly Bearing though, not Somber. Yeah, yeah, Smithing. But not... Do you know the fast way down to the Smithing Stone Bell Bearing? In Rio... Lucaria Crystal tunner, Tunnel? Yeah. Like yeah, the... but the... But Falling Star is Somber Bell Bearing, do you know? No, 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 I'm just saying for the, <clears throat> the Smithing Sevens that you get, but... Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah. So you would go Star get the Bell Bearings, this. get a plus 12. Sure. And then, yeah. I can do that. I can work on that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. With Raya. I got a watchdog staff. I'm going to grab the Pretty ones bad. here, I guess. Did you check uh, round table? No. Can you check if you're doing uh, that? If not, it's fine. I'll check eventually. I was going to go try to do Raya really quick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so that sounds good. And then bell bearings after that. I could check, uh, I could check, um, after Raya, I think, would be fine. You're pursuing plus nine right now? Yep. Okay. It's 1,000 to buy her necklace. Yep. Think so. Perfect. Jesus wheel. I'll try to do the skip, Gino. I don't know if I'll do it well, but I'll try. Oh, you're saying from Ruined Labyrinth. Yep. I actually don't know that. Okay, that's fine. Do you know the direction where the... Um... The stones are? I could probably figure it out. Oh, there's Bloodhound's Fang in, in shop. Oh, shoot. Okay. I might go with a smithing weapon if this, like, plays out the way that I'm anticipating. Yep. Do you think I should just use, like, South Rail Lucaria since I don't know the fast way down from Moon Labyrinth? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't do anything you don't know. Okay. Any reason to get the Bogart Grace that you're seeing? Uh... Not that I see. I'm going to grab it just in case. I don't think I'm being contested on it. Yeah, they're they're almost 100% going to have the Somber 9 square. Yeah, I'm fairly certain that this perfectly is perfectly fine. Because the... yep. We have to be really aware of the top left, bottom, or sorry. Yeah, top left, upper right diagonal if they do get plus 9. Yep. But you are one up on horse bosses, one up on tree bosses. Oh, that's right. Okay, yeah. I gotta mark that. Yep. Okay, I'm on my way to Raya. And then I'll immediately go towards the bell bearing. Do you think I should... Yeah. Should be getting plus nine very soon. Okay, they did catacombs. I... Don't care about that too much right now. Yeah, that's okay. Well, we, we decide we're going to give that to them anyways. Yep. But I think Josh I, I is going Josh for plus is doing nine. nine. So let's hope you just had a little bit of a faster route. No, there's no way. I, I also well, killed the extra troll for runes, so. I see. Where are you at with acquiring that? You're well, I'm seven in Halig Tree. I'm getting the 50k. Sure. Okay. And then I will be at plus nine in probably about like two minutes. I am about to get Raya, hopefully, here. I'll just go square off the whole match. Okay. I do like the smithing stone play into the, the like, the bell bearings. Yep. Okay. Nice. I've got all smithing the stones, stone. so I'm hitting the EG now. Very surprised it's not marked yet. That, that might have meant to snipe, but I... Yeah, like maybe I don't a snipe know. on NPCs. Maybe. Maybe they're just thinking to surround the center square. 
potentially. And let us get the free sentinel. Like that, I was saying earlier, one advantage we may have in matches is that we kind of intimidate people on fast boss kills. I hope which so. Can be good. My Vare was very fast, so it's possible yeah. if that was yeah, being yeah. contested. It was like a perfect Vare. I got really lucky. Okay, hey, so. well, if I if I actually somehow get this plus nine, then we are actually just golden. I think we're doing really well. Hopefully, we'll see. You're almost upgrading right now. Right? Uh, I'm running to the portal in a second. It's gonna be close, ma'am. Well, the fact I that they don't have it yet, I, maybe I shouldn't. I shouldn't have killed the troll. Like I, I really just thought. It's that okay. I... Don't worry, because guess well, yeah, what? Well, I'm not worrying. Even but if I'm just we saying... don't get the, even if we don't get the square, you have a plus nine. Yep. And Gino with a plus nine is one of the scariest things. As long as I don't have to fight Vike. Do you think I should try to do the, uh... Do you think I should try to do the Falling Star and Ultis with a plus 12? Does it give me do fives that. and sixes? Or just sixes? Uh, I believe just sixes and then like a somber five or something. Okay. I'm really close to getting this here. Yeah, if they get it now, that that means the troll was was oh, the difference here. Oh my god, what is happening right now to me? Oh my god, <laughs> just very intimidatingly swinging my weapon right now for absolutely no reason. Let's oh, I somehow go, got it. dude. I think it's okay. 18, 18 strength, 17 dex. I kind of like you pursuing center square. Will that be asking too much of you? Nope. Let's just see if there's anything else really quick. So there's Erd Tree, Avatars, and Physical Flask tiers. Those are Unless you think I should go for Falling Star. What'd you say? You do that? Yeah, I like the Falling Star play right now. And then Tree Bosses. Or, sorry, Horse Bosses. I'm going to Memory of Grace out of this cave. I only have 153. I'm going to go for the Altus alt Falling Star because no other one makes sense. So It's faster and you have a plus 9. So we snipe them then. That, that must like Maybe I we snipe so. them on NPCs. All right. I got the first spell bearing. Nice. Okay. Well. Okay. Got the first one. I'm going to go for the 1 now. I'm just going to run from South Rhea. I'm sorry about not knowing the jump. That's the, it's that. only like 20 or 30 seconds slower, so it's fine. Okay, I'll try yeah, to do Yeah, you shouldn't do anything that tunnel. you're not used to doing because no, it waste yeah, a lot more time. No, yeah, I agree with you. Um, after this, I'll go get the money to upgrade to like a plus 12. Okay, and I I, I like the Garonk for me into Black Lake Kindred. I like that a lot for you. Uh, it creates a lot of pressure. Um, I do think that one of them is going to do Earth Tree Avatars, maybe. So okay. I don't think that that's going to be super threatening really for that. row column five. But I mean, um, we could. Any strong plays from them, um, like in Real Lucaria at all? No, I just see Remembrance there. I'm going to get the Grace just for Renala purposes. by some like total meme hitbox somehow. Did you die? No, no, I didn't die. That's good. Nice job. Uh, we have, you, you started the same class as me, right? Yep. We have 10 arcane on this character. I don't know how I feel about committing 30 arcane. No, I, I don't think we need it at this point. We're in very good shape. As what about, like if you're going for smithing stone. Yep. And you and you get that, then all of a sudden like gold free becomes a huge threat to us in a double bingo. Yeah. Almost. So I, I, I could I could even go. I could push her after this. Or do you want me to? I mean I have South Rio Lucaria. Okay. Well so you. do I. But Okay, that's fine. Is that Josh? Yeah. So he did the uh Mogwin Dynasty ones. 
I, I'm going to go to Ranala. Let's set up on this on sure. this thing here. Sounds and, good. I think and, we're ahead yeah. on this. Do you think I even go for this kit? Or should I play it safe? Just, uh... I'll go for this kit. Okay, sure. Okay. I'll get the grease. It's like right by the You can grease, miss the right? skip like twice and still be faster, so. Okay. And if not, I'm sorry. No, that's okay. How much would that square be worth? It's, uh, maybe I, I, I'm going to go set up Academy. Sure, that's fine. And then possibly I just go to Garonk instead and Black Blade Kindred just to get up to the square so we're get a bigger margin, but. Okay, well, I already made a mistake. I have a really weird habit of, like, not jumping at the right second on this. It's okay. Ooh, I got it, I think. Nice. I did. Let's go, dude. Happy about that. All right, so I've got Academy set up. Um, okay. I think I'm just... We could really just force the line, but... I mean, it, it, okay, if you get that square, I'm immediately going to go to Ranala. Okay. And then probably just rush Godfrey, I guess, after... Like, I don't know. How many points is that? Mm. I don't know. Just hope I get this. It's probably a square off R1. Sorry, square off R2, square off R1, and it breaks them, right? The crystallion? Yeah, I think it's 75, yeah, so that should. Okay. Nice spin to start. Okay. Probably just R1s. Nope. I do square offs, R R1s R1. or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Probably repose even. Mm, maybe. I'm gonna try a repose and see. Okay. It was bad. We'll do our is, own. Is that your second bell bearing or first? Yep. First. Okay. Sorry, nice. second. I'm gonna get Hallow Tree runes after an upgrade. Just in the future, I, th I think it's better to get the. It's better to get the cave one second, or like the pickup. I'm in. Uh, why is that? Well, j just because you can't warp out. I have memory of grace, but yeah, I understand what. Okay, you're yeah, yeah, okay. Saying. That's that's perfectly fine too. Because I had 153 runes. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. Um. So. Do yeah, you I'm gonna know... try to do BBK after this. You are going to, or do you want me to try? Well, I'm I'm right there. I've already okay, taken sure, the portal, sure, sure. so. Oh, perfect. Then yeah, you, definitely better for you to do it. Yeah, like I'm probably gonna kill Garonk. And how many does the double bingo get us? I don't. I don't know. So we get an ads. extra one. Plus four. So we'd be at eleven. Okay. Which so means we need two more. So if I kill Garonk, Hindred, and then, or or unless. Why don't I go for Ranala right now? Sure. Yeah, that padding? makes sense. That makes sense. Okay. Yeah, I'm I guess gonna I made get a my weapon mistake, and but... then I will go to Ranola. Um, where am I going right now? Okay. How much is it gonna cost to buy these? Not not too much. It's only three of each. Never mind. I don't have to worry about money. And I already picked some up, so I have this. I'll work on that, and then... Okay, so... I'll do her with a plus 12. That's completely fine. I'm assuming they're prioritizing Ranala right now. You would think. Do you think it's worth pressing since there's nothing else in there? When do we do um... this stuff? I feel like I'm ahead. I feel like I'm ahead. I don't know. Wrong. Should be dead. Okay. I'm gonna press him. Sure. Let's say we lose out on it. It's not that 
it's still a remembrance for capital access technically for me i guess i could go for godfrey although let me just look at the rest of the board and what i need to achieve remembrance um they might be scrambling maybe i could like Sorry, what are you doing? I'm, I'm just gonna go kill a magworm, I guess. I'm getting I'm getting the key to press that line. Do you, I don't know if it's the right move though. I think it's, looking right at now timing. it is very low risk. I like, feel like it's it's fine. Like I don't think that they were anticipating that column. I could be wrong though. I feel like they might have been a little bit more focused on row five being concerning. So you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna continue with this. Okay. I hope it's the correct choice. Like at this point, row four is their only chance, right? Yeah, so Renala is very important. So if that's the case, if we see Renala get ticked, mm. um, I can either do Ultis Hero's Grave or um, you potentially could do Vike. I don't think I'm in a really great position to do Or Vike. just tree bosses, I mean. Or just tree bosses. I do. So the, the tree bosses goes really well with the avatars. I could see that being a play that they're making. I don't think yep. it's a strong play relative to their board positioning, but well, I could see that as a play. It's desperation. They have they have like basically nothing at this point, so they need to try to do something. I guess avatars physic tiers, though, is something. That's what I'm saying. Is I, yeah, yeah, I do okay. think that that could be some synergy that one of them may work towards potentially, yep. but maybe they're in a bit of a scramble mode currently to, to block some of what we're doing. Yeah, I'm just gonna I'm hold carrying Kindred around for a way bit. too many runes on my body right now. I didn't realize I was doing this. I'm just gonna hold Kindred because I don't have a lot of HP, and also I Fine. highly doubt they're gonna even bother trying it. If they start building up that diagonal, then maybe I don't I'll think do it, Kindred but... really matters too much. Why'd you? Okay, I see. Never mind. Well, it's kind of it's weird right now because we have such a huge lead that I I'm not even sure what to do because there's too many options. What are our um, biggest concerns? Roll five, or sorry, roll four. Roll four is the only That's play. That's the only thing. So I really need to do something about Renala. Basically. So sure. if you could um, send some luck my way for Renola, <laughs> so that she just gives yeah, me the luck. summons I need. Because uh, this is my least favorite boss in the game. Really? I just, I just hate her. I just think she's trash. She looks cool. At she least. looks cool. Her arena is amazing. She doesn't deserve it. They could have made her so cool, I think. They ruined they ruined her. Yeah, I'll probably go for tree bosses after, I guess. I do you're gonna be behind as as heck, but sure. Um if But I can yeah, I mean you could try to snipe. I know you're super souped up currently with your blood on Spang. All right, I'm gonna use my runes before I decide something bad's gonna happen. Mm, I'm just gonna go for some health. All right, entering Red Wolf in a bit here. Should be a very quick fight. Nice Magma Worm. Wolf is very dead. Nice. That was a very quick fight with Squirrel. Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna want that blue. I'm gonna want that blue.
Are you just gonna pinch Godfrey, or are we gonna try to do a uh, Godfrey play? Oops. Um, we might not need it. Okay. We're behind on remembrances, in theory. I'm gonna have one. Yeah, I'm, I'm just going for avatars because it lines up with a lot of stuff. And and I may have an advantage on the tree bosses, which blocks as well, so... Fine, I, I think for. I'm okay with it. I, I think I'm okay with what you're doing. I think we might have caused some panic, so we might have enough distraction that you actually get away with that kill. Oh, okay, that's okay really I bad. lied to you. Okay, so they have Physic Tears, and then they have at least three tree bosses. I don't think they have more than that, but... Can I go for Altus Hero's Grave? Sure. Just to, like, I'm going guarantee... Into uh, I'm in Rinala right now, but I can look at the board in a second here. Do you think square off R2 on her? Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, wait, in phase one? Yeah. Um, I actually don't know. I feel like just R1-ing. Yeah, I think R1s were better. Like normal r one so you don't waste your blue if you don't have enough. I got some extra. So if, if you get that, then I'm probably going to pivot off and then just kill Kindred and then we just try to win on Bingos. Okay. You have to hug the right wall for the invader here, right? Yeah. The mountain wall. One summon. We got wolves. This is such a weird game just because like... Oh, should uh, I finish okay. it? Uh, yeah, finish, finish it? it because we, we want... Well, Kay. I would just finish it. Capital. Yeah, just kill her. Okay. Okay. That was really close. Yeah, I I, I probably should have gone for it. Yeah, I probably would have gotten it, but... Hopefully, I'm going to beat them to Hero's Grave. So this was a good play then. Yeah, I think it was the right call. Okay, she's dead. You have a weapon working, by the way? Plus 12 for okay. a square off. Okay, big block on their part. Very, very good play. Um, yeah, they're going to start getting some squares pretty quick here. Yep. Like tree boss as well. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Should I go towards um God, what do I what do I work on? You're doing Altus right now. Altus Did you get a remembrance weapon? Um I can go check it. And there's still Godric on the board. The problem is it's Renala, and I don't remember if you can use just the sorcery or just the staff. Oh, is it oh is it always a sorcery yeah. or staff? Okay. For her it's trash. Should I work on horse bosses? Sure. Could kill DTS for that. Yeah, oh, capital is just not like super oh, important though. Oh, they're so bad. Um. Okay, I'll try to work on horse bosses. Where am I? I'll try to work on horse bosses. I think right now. I do feel like I might be a little behind, but maybe it wasn't contested for us. So, we'll Ugh, see. I made a huge mistake. It's alright. I just, I, in the hero's grave, I got hit and it slowed me down. Tree Sentinel is dead. Oops. That's one. If 
feel like I'm gonna get sniped on this, so if I do, I'm real sorry. Okay. Do you think trying to go for DTS is too ambitious? I mean, it's it just might Godfrey. Be, yeah. I, th I think so. Okay, I'll just do... I know, okay, I know what I'll do. Nice block by, uh, by Bushy. Okay, so they're, they're, they're recovering. I do think we're more built than them, but very, very good block by Bushy. I think I should have sent you there first. It was quite close. There were, yeah, I, I should have gone to Ranala, like looking back on it, because yeah. I, I would have had it for sure. Yeah, I think so. I probably would have ended the game. That's okay, though. Just got to keep going. Two horse bosses. Can you see my marks anymore? That was you, okay. Um this is a very good block by them. Where am I? Holy goodness gracious me. Be three. Any other reason to grab this grace down here? I don't think so. I'm fighting Kindred now, by the way. Okay, that's a good choice. I think, like, Except picking up. I kind of wanted to hold off on it because Slash is so bad against him, but. I'll do the Altus Knight's Cap here. Hopefully I get this square. I don't think they were working on it. I think they were pretty tied up with what we were doing. I honestly... I don't know how I feel about me. What I did? Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, Gino. I'm lost today. <laughs> I am I I was a little lost there. Nice. I'm so sorry. I realized what you were doing when I was. It's, yeah, it's fine. Talking, um, so. GGs. I'm I'm on my fourth horse. Okay. Like now, at this point, it's interesting. Do we go for Godfrey Bingo, and win? I can do one more remembrance, quick. Yeah. After I do this. I think it's very unlikely that they're going to go for it because it's just such a huge time loss. So if sure. we go for it, it's pretty high percentage. But yeah, the problem is I don't have any remembrances killed. So again, I'm the one with the I do. very strong weapon. But yeah, that is true. That's okay. I can do Godfrey with a plus 15 straight sword. That's not a problem. Yeah, square off R2s are good on him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yep. So I would almost just uh, like if you're close to finishing that, you can finish it and then. Yep. You, you can also I'm do thinking. DTS as your last horse boss at this point now, probably. I, I think that's really, I think that's really greedy. Yeah, but I, bingo I wins for us. 
So you're doing a two and one. If you don't get it, then are you sure? Yeah, because we're at ten, okay. and that yeah, square right, is one, right, and right, then plus right. two. I'm just gonna go kill Lanciax. Okay. Sounds um, good. I'm gonna go get my five. Sorry, my um. I'm gonna go get my um upgrades, and then I'm gonna I'll, I'll okay. push DTS. Unless you want me to go into capital instead. No, I. I'm okay with this, Gino. Yeah, it makes more sense you, for you to do it. If you trust me uh, to do it. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, like, I think you can get... Like, I, I, I don't think they're going to contest it, I, realistically. I think, I feel and if they, like... If, if they do, then I have a one-on-one -on -one against somebody, I, and I'm just I, killing bosses, so... Yeah, I'm okay with that. <laughs> I don't think it makes any sense for them to go to Godfrey. I mean, Bushy well, might, does, but the block... <laughs> it does make sense, but no, they no, probably no, it, shouldn't. It, you're right, you're right, you're right. That was uh, not a great statement of mine. No, no, um, I, I know what you're saying. They should not yeah. go for it because they're in it, such a tough spot here that if they waste their time and we don't and we just like let them go for it, then it'd yeah. be huge time loss. It's kind of a there's nothing else there. I mean I guess there's Fia's champs to get through sewer mode maybe, but I I guess. Would you even go that way? But I don't know. I'm gonna do Radon. Okay, yeah. Unless you want to do Nefali, that's still there, but I'm sure someone's doing that. I I mean, I could. No, I, I don't think. I don't think there's a point. <laughs> I don't. I, I have Radon active. Oh, poison moss fighter. Do you think they're gonna be? Do you think they're gonna be blocking, and then the one other person is gonna be trying to snipe? This is I'm just fighting Lance X right now. I, I didn't hear what you said. Oh, it's continue with your excellent Lance X fight. What are they? Oh, tree? Okay. It's expected from Josh because he did Why'd it take so first? long? He must have done something. Right, he must have done something else. Do you think it's DTS? Not sure. I'm going to do. Uh, I think he I'm going to do painting. He doesn't have Renala, though. It wasn't him who did Renala. I'm just going to do painting. That seems like a very unsuspecting square. Oh, wait, I also have a shit ton of runes. I might get 30 arcane. Yeah, just do that. How are you doing on Vigor? Very Excellent good. Job I, I, I have enough for 24 arcane. Yeah, um, 24 arcane. Yeah. Do you want Can me you to kill... see where I'm at after? No, that's okay. That's okay. Just focus okay. on your thing, and I'm just going to sure. clean up squares. Okay. And, yep. Okay. Honestly, do you know, like, mm -hmm. if I get horse bosses. I probably should have finished that first. Like, gone to DTS first. I, I... Oh. Should I still yeah. do it? Well, what? Go to DTS first, finish horse bosses, and then kill Radon. I'm like, festival's activated. I'm going in right now. Well, he's a horse boss, too. Oh, he's a horse boss! Oh, my God! Oh, I forgot about Leonard! Oh, God. I'm so sorry. Leonard, you didn't deserve that. <laughs> Holy crap. Thanks, Gino. Sorry about that. No, it's fine. <laughs> Leonard. Oh. Uh, All right, I'll summon the boys since I can. Yep. And it's faster. Like I said, I'm oh, just doing paintings. This is a very unsuspecting square. Sounds and good. And then I'll probably go for 30 arcane after. Yeah, I'm okay with that. Just do avatar or something. Well,
Oh no. What's it? What's happening? They staggered him super early before he even buffed, but that's okay. It'll be fine, I think. Okay, can you buff? You silly man! <laughs> what a shit show, dude. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to think about this match after this is done. Just think of what. Like, I think the biggest mistake was not going for Ronaldo there when I was. For you. Like, I I got the key. What was it? What was it? That's fine. He's going to capital. I'm gonna get horse bosses. So I did. Can I just check with you? I did tree sentinel. I did limgrave knight's cav. I did. Weeping Knight's Cav, and I did Kayla Knight's Cav. That's four. I'm I'm sorry. I'm it's fighting fine. I, an I avatar. Talked. Yeah, I know you're. I'm, you're busy. Oof, it's not great damage. Probably Bridge Grail. Shoot. I'm gonna go to Bridge. I was gonna fight this avatar and get the runes, but I'm gonna I'm gonna kill Bridge Grail for the runes. Is for 30 arcane. That should get me there. I go to capital. So I killed Tree Sentinel. I killed the other Knight's Cav. I killed Weeping Knight's Cav. I could kill... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Five, five bosses. Got it. What an excellent block by Bushy, though. With Renala. It was a good, good, strong play. Well, it, w it was obvious. and So I... he's going to go capital. Do I even okay. go capital at this point? Um, well, you killed DTS or, or, or... No, I did not kill DTS. I don't think he's going to go capital. Can I go Vike? Sure. Okay. We just need one more square, so... I'm going to go Vike. I'm allowed yeah, to that's do fine. That. I, I hate Vike, but... I just... Well, you might not... It. If I get this kill on, on Bridge Grail, then it should be over. Okay. I could see how much Arcane I get, too. I don't think it'll be close. 21, yeah. Alright, I'm going to Vike. Can you let me kill Vike? <laughs> well. Just like hold off. Yeah, I'm definitely not gonna do that. <laughs> oh my god. I cannot believe I forgot Radon is a horror boss. Should be dead. Okay. Surely I have enough runes for this. Imagine Did I you don't. Kill the I actually. Tops? Oh my god, I'm short 2,000 oh. runes. No, you're not. <laughs> yeah, I am. Go to mountain tops. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, I am. Just like you knew that Radon was a horse boss. <laughs> I think nice I definitely one. or Altus Hero Grave. I think I, I I wouldn't have minded if they had to do Vike, but at least going for that kind of corrected the mistake. Yeah. All right. I should get this here. Okay. Well, I I don't, I don't think GGs, you made any you know? mistakes. I think I definitely. Like, I didn't. Got... I didn't put you on Ronaldo when I should have. Well, I I was going. I was gonna go for it, but then I was like, well, I I'm just gonna go for Garong instead. But yeah, I should have put you on it though. I but I I just felt like I maybe had the the time. I was really close. I mean, I was halfway done with the fight and with one well, summon. It, it was but, the um... exact situation we had in one of the practice matches, right? Where I killed Godric, and then it was like, oh yeah, I'll, you can go for the 
great rune, and then we ended up getting sniped on it, right? Sure. Which yep, is exactly what right. happened here. You are right. You are right. Yep. So, um, so making that decision, and like, I blasted Red Wolf, but you would have like one shot Red Wolf. Yeah. So like, even things like that, you know, you would have just m completely minimized the fight time. So yeah. um, I do think we played well, though, Gino. I do think we had a really nice plan this game. We created some really tough pressure very early. Yeah. Very early. So nice job killing things. Excellent work on your yep. your killing. <laughs> Except somewhat like ugh, that tree sentinel, like if they were contesting, which I don't think they did, but if they were trying, like if, if somebody were to contest that, I probably sure. would have lost that. Tree sentinel is one of the bosses that you definitely want to be like. Yeah, I just um, I just whiffed with square off on him. Oh, I like see. that was I just whiffed some hits. Are you ready for post game? Okay. Good job. I'm proud of us. We'll have things to talk about later for sure, but I think early pressure was good. Yeah. Are they going in first? Oh. Oh. Welcome in, guys. <laughs> Welcome in. GG. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I didn't yep. mean to like, cut you off there. No, no, no. It was all good. Oh, it was perfect timing. All Blue right. Gamers. Welcome in. GG's, everyone. GG's to Team Brina Machina for pulling the dub out on that one. That was a very uh, intense match. Uh, very strong <laughs> early performance for sure, too. Um, so first off, for, for, for Red Team here, for Team Brino, uh, what was the early game plan? What was the late game plan? Communications. Give us the, the deets on that. You want me to oh, go right. this time? Yeah, <laughs> but, no, yeah basically like what we were thinking. <laughs> um, yeah, so we just divided the early squares. It seemed like it was worth to go... Like, there were quite a few early squares on this one, but three Sentinel plus zero and NPCs lined up, so that made sense. Um, and then, yeah, just, like, going for plus nine, go, doing a lot of the boss killing after that. Um, yeah, I mean, it, it was pretty... Like, I felt like it was pretty straightforward, but it's always nice when you can actually, like, get the squares that you're rushing for. So I'm not sure if right. they were contested, but... Uh, well, but our, yeah. our game plan was to look at the, the column one, um, and Josh was going to go for NPC invaders, and mm -hmm. if you guys claimed both Tree Sentinel and friendly NPCs, he was going to start prioritizing Somber 9. Um, but there there was a bit of an incident there. And oh, yeah, like... As soon as our column one threat was was dead it was just chasing for the rest of the game mm. yeah i had a major execution mistake on the npcs that cost me just a ton of time and i don't think i was i don't like even if i did like just went for it straight away i don't think i would have contested the plus nine fast enough mm. but um yeah the, the the early game really messed me i also like i accidentally clicked cancel character creation at the beginning of the match and like lost 15 <gasps> seconds to that no Oh, and like, no. it was just like some very silly mistakes on my end. And then uh, we got really close to like beating the, the BBK. Um, mm -hmm. Oh, really? You sniped, you sniped on, on Renala. It was a great Renala uh, block. I was like, I think ah. she was like halfway, maybe a little bit over. She had only one summon for me, but it was a good, it was a very good block. I think it was you, Bushy, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yep. it was well played. We, 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 I think Gino and I, determined that we definitely sent Gino we should have sent Gino there but um the way that we had played the lines I was building us a, a smithing weapon and Gino got the somber nine with uh, me getting the bell bearings and I, I still think it would have been a stronger play for Gino to to force Renala but uh you had an excellent block on that it was really good yeah I think like I one of my biggest or hero's grave right after that which I mean, at, at that point, like when you're losing like that, it's it's just desperation plays. You you play very yeah. optimistically, hoping that the opponents are doing exactly what you need them to. I, I knew Gino could be ahead of me on it, but I, I just said, all right, if he yeah. is, then we lose. Like, <laughs> I think by far my biggest mistake this match was like as soon as I saw the tree sentinel plus zero, I considered going for plus nine because I knew Gino was going to go. For, I, I had a very strong feeling Gino was going to go plus nine with this board. Yeah, and uh, I was like. I, I should have just stuck with my gut and just gone straight for it because I think I could have gotten it. Yeah, had, had you gone for it right away? Well, I actually, I was thinking that you were going to go, or at least one of you were going to go for, uh, like, plus nine immediately. So I was actually, I was fully prepared to, like, just not get that square and just kind of, like, stealthily get a plus nine. But my, my hope was to use the, 
like use Mogwin for the nine and runes instead of the instead of Halig Tree. Oh yeah. Because I did the four invaders in Mogwin. Yeah. yeah, that makes sense. But I was I was just way too slow on the execution. And I, I think I died like three times doing it. It's it, um I don't know what the exact issue was, but I know sometimes they like spam swarm of flies. And when they do that, it's like a nightmare because you're stuck on this little ledge. God, I didn't even know that was a thing that could happen. Oh, they can <laughs> that do awful. that too. It's so Lovely. fun. Mm -hmm. There's all sorts of fun things that can happen there. <laughs> but, yeah, no, I, I didn't turn around and block for the um, the it's the Sanguine Noble. And so he attacked while <gasps> oh, falling off and killed uh, me. Oh, it was the first. Oh, yeah. no. Yeah. Oh. Did you get the grace? Uh, No. Oh. Well, no. where does it does it take you to the beginning, like where you get through the portal, or? Uh, so the Sanguine Noble is uh, still still in the no, snowfield. No, yeah, he. Oh, yeah, oh, Sanguine Noble. Just, my bad. Okay, I thought you meant yeah. the other guy. Yeah, no, I I skill issued once and just rolled off the cliff, and then the second time I went to him, he killed me. But whenever he fell off the cliff, and <laughs> so it was just like, oh that was, no, that was my early I hate day, that death because like yeah, you have to like walk on foot to him, and there's no good grace, I don't think, in that area. Like it's uh. Yeah. But, you know, it happens. It's the way it, it goes does. sometimes. It does, yep. Sometimes we try to cheese them, and sometimes they get us back. So. Yeah. Yeah. It was, uh, it was very impressive, though, uh, from uh, Burrito Machino, to be honest, and, like, how quickly they responded. Like, as soon as Bushy uh, marks that Renala Square, Gino went straight for Hero's Grave. Uh, Bree went straight for uh, bosses that ride a horse, which is blocking the last two p uh, potential bingos with that Renala Square. They're like, okay, you know what? They got one. Let's just go ahead and block everything else just to make sure that we can just get the other squares that we need to. Um, so that was a just very quick yeah. reaction play that I thought was uh, just very nicely done. Um, yeah, the horse uh, bosses was kind of close. Did you know? Wait, sorry, sorry, what did you say? <laughs> which hero's grave did you go for? Uh, I went for the Red Wolf. Uh, and, and you went for it right after I got Renala. No, I, 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 well, so what I, yeah, like the way the game was going, we knew that the only hope was for row four. And so yeah. I, no, I started going for that before it was done. Like just okay. as kind of insurance on it. I, I'm not you, sure how much mm -hmm. before, but I'm pretty sure it was like a couple minutes before actually. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I might have mm -hmm. misrem misremembered. Mm -hmm. But yeah, it was, overall though, it was just the, it really covered a lot of ground uh, for sure on, on their end. Um, but honestly, like even even then, like was, you guys, uh, Joe W. Bush, you guys still covered a lot of mm -hmm. ground for having such a rough early game, um, and being able to then just like still get the uh, necessary blocks to try and uh, make it as far as possible, and, and still trying to like create some pressure with that Ronaldo Square and everything. I think that would have been really huge. If uh, honestly, if if Josh uh, possibly didn't die to 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 BB care there, and you guys started activating that dag oh, a little yeah. bit more. I think there would have been some some nice nice pressure coming out from you guys that you could have possibly have turned us around a little bit more. Um, yeah, the, the BDK later was close. The horse bosses were kind of. I, I was on my fourth. That's okay. Gino had a really nice moment where he reminded me that Radon is in fact a horse boss. That was uh, going to be so, my fifth. Yeah. Um, that that was a really good reminder. Yeah. I I forgot about Leonard. The most important part. How so. could you forget him? I don't know. I feel terrible, but now I won't ever. So the best horse. <laughs> yes. Best boy. Um, but yeah, but GG's to to both teams. Uh, thank you very much for playing today, guys. It was a really, really fun to watch. Uh, so thank you very much for uh, taking the time to play today. And uh, best of luck to you guys next week, uh, Saturday, for your round three matches. And I hope you have a good rest of your day. Oh, wait, hold on. Actually, wait, sorry, sorry. Blanks, do you have anything uh, you would like to ask the players to? Yeah, I mean, I was just going to I was gonna ask Gino what your thought process was on the leaving Blackbutt Kindred. You did Garonk, and then you kind of just like left. And that mm. square almost got taken. It didn't really like matter in the, you know, in the end. But I just want to hear what your thought process was on uh, leaving that BBK up. Uh, I just wanted more health, and then I was also thinking that it was what happened actually to us last match, where um, Puppery took Blackway Kindred, and then Garonk was there. So like, you just think it's like okay, somebody is right there, so mm. probably it's going to be hard to snipe him on it. So that's why I just left for a little bit. Mm. Um. But yeah, probably it would have been a decent idea to go for it. I mean, blocking that diagonal was something mm. that probably should have been done earlier. But mm. yeah, there there were definitely like there were some misplays, I think. But mm -hmm. th like maybe that was one of them. I don't know. But yeah, that that's just what I was thinking for that. Yeah, gotcha, gotcha. 
Um, but yeah, GG's to everyone, guys. And uh, thank you again for playing. And we'll we'll see you guys next week. Yep, thank GG's. Thank you for having yeah, us, GG's, GGs, guys. No problem. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Uh, see ya. Oh, boy. That was not good, dude. That was really bad. I, I had two... I, I'm not sure if the, the Kindred was a huge mistake, leaving that. I mean, I, I don't know. Here, let me pull my chat back up. Um, it's, did Josh say he died to the kindred? So I almost got sniped on that also. Like that was a huge mistake to not go for Ronaldo, dude. And it's the second time I've done something like that, where I get priority on a square, like obviously not knowing I did. And then I kind of let Bree do it where I have the lead. Um, and I should have just done it anyways. So yeah, that was like, it, it was really an obvious play to just for me to go for it too. And I would have beaten them on it. And then once you get that square, it like... Especially because the, the diagonal was open for them and the row. So it just totally shuts down anything that they could have done. And uh, why is my chat... My chat is like trying to scroll for the entire match. So I'm like, <laughs> like, look what I'm seeing, dude. I don't think my chat is going this fast. <laughs> okay, I need to see proper chat, dude. Why is this so messed up? But yeah, going going for not going for Ronaldo was like just a huge mistake, man. That was really stupid. And then like the game's the game's totally over at that point. And then I also my tree sentinel was garbage. And like I I I'm I feel like I'm decent at the tree sentinel fight, but I just I got hit and then it kind of just messed everything up because I had heal and then the stun and then and I started whiffing some hits. Kindred was fine. Gronk was fine. Falling Star Beast was okay. Lanciax was a little scuffed. You know what? Like, the, the common theme, I guess, in, in this bingo is that... It... Like, if you... So, let's say if we lost on those two early squares, like, how do we come back from that, dude? Like, it's it's basically over. It, it really... Um, like, you just get steamrolled if you don't get the early squares, it seems, dude. Like, especially if you get sniped on them. Yeah, Lanciax was... I, I messed up on one of the dodges on Lance. Like, I guess it was it was fine, but it wasn't, like, perfect. But, yeah, it's tough with the season, dude. Like, if you fall behind early, on especially on, like, a line like that, that's why that early game execution is so important, dude. It's the most important part of this this bingo. So, I, I don't think... They, they must not have... Cont they didn't contest plus zero. Like, Josh went for invaders and... Wish he went for catacombs. Like, if if someone contested me on that, I wouldn't have gotten the square with how slow that fight was. Um, but but yeah, ultimately he's still thirteen to seven, I guess, right? But it just, yeah, I just I should have pulled the trigger on the Ronaldo, dude. I I'm not sure what I I can't remember what I was thinking. I I honestly can't remember. I I can't remember if I was thinking that they were already ahead of me on it, and so I shouldn't have gone for it, or. Or if I just thought we were so ahead that that like uh, I could let Bree do it instead, but I should I hundred percent should have gone for it, and then that opens up Redan after with the horse bosses, and then basically at that point I open the capital and I just win the game. So I'm not sure what I thought at that point. I really don't know. I I'll have to like think about it because I I just don't remember. Um, like I, I think I, I went to get the key and I was like, oh, I can just, you know what? I, I think I thought I was so ahead that I didn't even have to worry about it. I think that's what I thought. Cause I was like, oh yeah, I'll go kill Garonk, Kindred for two extra squares. And then, you know, we get Ranala, And then at that point that would have like the bingo would have won the game. And so I think that's what I was thinking. Like two, plus two. And then I, I don't know. But, yeah, that was... Well, it's not even hindsight. Like, I've done that before. And, it, like, it's always worked out. But it just... It made the game a lot more difficult than it should have been. And, it, like, it was still 13-7 to 7 and stuff. But had I gone for Ranala and gotten it, which I likely would have... um, It's just, like... The, it's... To like, it was already basically over, but it would have been totally over at that point. Like, just nothing they could have done at that point, so... So yeah, that, that execution, I think, uh, or it's not even execution, it's just like making a bad play. So anyways, thanks for uh, hanging out today, guys.
that certainly i feel like that was probably out of the i think we played five matches so far that was probably the worst one we've played so but like that being said though it's still like we still played pretty well though right it, it was just the mistake that i made maybe, not going for ranala was like a huge mistake best, not ever but we still played well otherwise i think except for my plus zero tree sentinel that was really not so good But yeah, I still think it was our worst game, but we didn't play badly, I guess. I, I might have misspoke a bit there, but... Um, I guess, actually, let me see if I missed any stuff. And yeah, I think I, this game just shows how tough it is. If you if you get sniped... Well, I, did, wait, did, did they get sniped at the start? Maybe they didn't, dude. I, I can't remember if, if Josh was going for three NPCs or not, but... Yeah, they... they like, what they should have done, actually, they should have... So, so, like, if they were going to concede those two squares that line up, they should have immediately gone for the nine. Just to, like, s just squash any threat of a bingo there, because that's going to be built up. And not to mention it's corner square. Like, I think that was probably... That was probably probably their biggest mistake, actually, is not going for Sombra nine, which they easily would have beaten me out to, because I didn't, I didn't even take the most optimal pathing to it. So I killed the troll for some more levels. And the reason I did the reason I did that is because I just assumed that they would get it, and so I I, I mean, but yeah. As, as soon as we got that somber nine square, like it was basically it was basically over. I felt like. Um. All right. Let me thank some subs, and then we will raid somebody. Holy smokes, dude! All right, Skin Rocket. Thanks for the five gifted subs, dude. I appreciate that. Abe, thanks for the brand new sub. Elfman, thanks for the two thousand bits. Thanks so much, dude. Uh, Wets, thanks for the two-month resub. Dark Rapier with the two-year resub. Thanks so much, dude. Um, Remo6, thanks for the four-month resub. Uh, Chill Croet, thanks for the... I said that wrong for sure. Thanks for the brand-new sub, dude. Uh, Agoraphobic, thanks for the 100 bits. Maybe, Ricotta Man, maybe. thanks for the brand-new Prime best, sub. Uh, Mayu, thanks so much for the raid. I hope your stream was good if you're still here. Uh, Pixen, thanks for the four-month Prime sub. Uh, Ni Hao, thanks for the brand-new sub. Fat Sky, thanks for the two month prime sub. <laughs> Not your dad, thanks for the eleven month prime sub. Uh, Zena, thanks for the seven month resub. Uh, Kermit, thanks for the brand new prime sub. Yuha, thanks for the ten month prime sub. One crap, thanks for the brand new sub. Drunk, probably, thanks for the brand new sub as well. Uh, Dream has Ash, thanks for the brand new prime sub. Uh, Nessa Lynx, thanks for the brand new prime sub. Mister Whale, thanks for the brand new prime sub. <laughs> uh, Lost, thanks for the 15 month resub. Brew Crew, thanks for the four month prime sub. Ryura, thanks for the one year resub. Welcome back, dude. Uh, Brad Fortin, thanks for the two month prime sub. Obnoxious, thanks for the brand new sub. Uh, Nano, thanks for the brand new prime sub. Hoff, thanks for the donation, dude. Kill Millennia. It's too bad the first board got lost. I think, honestly, we would have had a less chance of winning on the first board, but there was Millennia, which would have been fun, but. Uh, Skystar, thanks for the brand new Prime sub, and Sturkus, thanks for the brand new sub, dude, as well. Um, you know what? I just realized, dude. I don't really have to end right now. So, maybe I don't. Like, usually after these bingo matches, I have stuff to do, but I actually don't today, so. <laughs> so, I guess, I guess I won't. I, I just I just thought about that, dude. I I'm I should be free for the rest of the night. I'm I'm not sure what I'll do, but what did you guys? Uh, does anybody have a clip of? Um. Also, uh, Sturkis, I don't know if I said thanks for that uh, brand new sub, dude. Did anyone have a clip of like the insane lingering hitbox on the Falling Star Beast? Like I got I something weird fucking happened there, right? Or am I insane? I'm gonna pull up the YouTube stream. Yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna lie though. I'm like, it's nice that we won and stuff and we played well, but the, 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 the issue I have is that the mistakes I made were so big. Maybe, maybe I'll give you the best. That it could have costed us potentially. Two months, but it will be more. Thank you for the wonderful content. Wait, was there a machine raid started? Love, machine love, machine love, machine <laughs> love. Well, yeah, I, I, I just forgot I can stream some more today. So, uh, Umbreon, thanks for the two month resub, dude. Okay, where's that Falling Star Beast?
Like, what was this weird meme that happened? Oh, so I guess the fight went pretty quick. Um, um, like in real Lucaria at all? No, I just see remembrance. So what happened? So I... Oh, it's just the rock. It lasts for a long-ass time, dude. Dang, okay. It just lasts for an insane amount of time. Whoa. And I got comboed into the other one. Dang, that was actually really dangerous. Like, total meme hitbox somehow. Like, what I thought in my brain is that I thought I just got hit by nothing. Dang, I didn't know about that. Whoa. Good thing I didn't die, dude. Yeah, well, yeah, it could have been bad, yeah. And, like, if I got hit by this last thing here, I would have died. I got hit by some, like, total meme hit. And I shouldn't have run back into it again, dude, but I, I didn't even notice. But it's weird, because there's another attack. I'm gonna get the great this one, like, you can just roll straight into this one. I'm gonna get the grace Like, no problem. Purposes. But yeah, I, I know one of the other attacks has a longer hitbox as well. Like, it, it is actually the one that comes after the triple. No, no, I didn't. Die. Total meme hitbox somehow. Like, this one, this one you can't roll into. This has a really long hitbox also. I don't know if I've ever fought Millennia with a curved greatsword before, dude. Yeah, I did die, but the death didn't matter. Like... I, yeah, I died to the Avatar, but I wasn't really too concerned about that, to be honest. Because I was just going to swap bosses anyways, and there was the stake on that boss, so. His damage is pretty weak, but the bleed's good. Yeah, that's the problem with mid-rolling right there. I, I You shouldn't even go for that if you're... Shouldn't even go for that if you're mid-rolling. Probably. Yeah, all this millennia practice. Well, I, I, I'm practicing here for not just bingo, to be honest, but... Wow, that R, that R1... Like, I, I was block-canceling that, too. Kind of deceptively slow. Maybe, maybe... I'll give you the best nut uh, Mayu, ever. thanks for the 14 month reset as well. Okay. Hope your stream is good. Yeah, I was I was gonna end stream, but I can stream for a bit longer. So. Can I do an R1? And probably I I don't know if you can do anything fancy on that one. I guess you kinda you kinda can use Bloodhound, but I don't know. Probably not a good idea. With like waterfowl being a possibility. Let's just see, like if I can. I wonder if that's actually safe. I'm not sure how much longer you're going to stream now, you guys. Uh, bingo is very, uh, it is very, like, draining, <laughs> I feel like, dude. Need to go, like, eat dinner and just chill for the rest of the night, probably. Especially two matches in a row is kind of insane. Oh, I guess I'm not getting that repost. Like, two day, two matches, uh, like, back-to-back -back days is kind of insane. Yeah, we did win. It just, I, I think. Definitely could have played better. Please reach. I, I don't think it was Bree, though. I think it was my fault, which honestly is, I, I prefer that because at least I know that I can just. Wow, that is safe, I guess. 
Like, I, I know that I can just correct it, you know? And and especially, that's only... We haven't done many bingo matches in, in Season 1. In Season 1, it took me probably at least four matches before I started, like, getting into it. So, like, and understanding it a bit more. Maybe, so, uh... Maybe it'll probably be the same case for this season, ever. dude. Congrats on your matches. Uh, Jimmy, thanks for the 17-month resub, dude. I appreciate that. I think a charged R2 and R1 actually is safe. That's kind of surprising, dude. Not, not a ton of weapons can do that. Like in phase two, especially. She starts kicking you. That was really stupid. There's no doubt it's a good weapon here. Good. No hit runs less draining than bingo. Well, yeah, definitely. <laughs> Yo, where did I get the steeple from? Anybody know? Where did I get that from? Great sword. Who drops a great sword? Oh, Kindred, dude. Oh, man. Okay. Well, there's no point in swapping, especially with like a solid weapon, but this would have been nice for Kindred if I had it by then. Yeah, not going for plus nine was definitely a mistake. And I think. Had they gotten it, the match would have been a lot closer. Probably. Just because... Yeah, I mean... I mean, it, it, you don't even have to explain it. It's like... If... If you are conceding two squares that you know are on a line, that you have a very high certainty that they're actually going to go for, then... You should make sure you, you have compensation somehow, right? Like that's the thing. You need compensation, which, unfortunately for them, they didn't have any. You probably do... Okay, maybe not. Ultras are honestly really bad on this fight. But they're not really bad, but... Like, a lot of... Uh, most weapons can get a bunch of extra hits in certain spots, but ultras just can't, really. At least not that I know of. They have good poise damage, I guess. Like, decent. You hate item... or collect item squares? I... I, I don't know. I mean... I don't, I don't hate them, but I certainly prefer just killing stuff more. Oh, what am I doing? Hmm. I wonder if there's any, like, crouch poke punishes that you can do somewhere. Maybe, maybe I'll be the best nut ever. Okay, that's... Ooh. Uh, Skipper, thanks for the brand new sub, dude. I appreciate that. What am I doing? Oh yeah, that was not safe, probably. I, 
actually used to prefer big weapons like this on Millennia, but the better I got at her, the more I don't like these weapons. Probably should have rolled into that, actually. Yeah, Blasphemous Blade is honestly one of the best weapons on this boss, which I didn't know about until very recently. I, I didn't know, like, it's like the Ash of War is so good, like, for knocking her down, and then you can kind of, like, chain it together. Sort of. Let's go on, Collins. Uh, fist weapons are very good against her. I wonder if I can... I didn't do it. Yeah, yeah stamp uppercut is, is actually solid here, but I, I don't really want to use it. Because I'm... That's kind of close. Oh, I guess that is good. But yeah, Blasphemous Blade is definitely one of the best weapons in the game. It's either it's either one or it's either two or three best weapon. You could even argue it's actually number one, to be honest. You wouldn't be crazy to say that. should stun basically every time oh just kidding <laughs> yeah because that i obviously that's not safe unless it stuns but i guess she she what that she probably ate the stun right there is what would have happened classic millennia Classic. What is top three? I think it's some order of Dark Moon Greatsword. Um, whoa, nice camera. Dark Moon Greatsword. Dark Moon Greatsword, Blossomous Blade, and maybe Bloodhound's Fang. Maybe. Like, Bloodhound's Fang's tough because... It's, it's so much better for a casual player. Like, it's such a good weapon for a casual playthrough. Versus, um, like, some other weapon. Just because you can spam the Ash of War all day long. But for, for like, no hit runs and stuff, it's kind of not great. So, so that's why it's, like... A little tricky, I guess. Oh boy. Ow. Kind of nice that we finally get a little, um, a little break, dude. Like, could you imagine doing three bingo matches in a row, like on? three days. I'm very surprised I didn't get hit there. Bloodhound's Fang's never in your top 10. It depends. No, no, no. I mean, Moog Spears, there's no chance Moog Spears better. Well. Again, like, I, I think the reason why Bloodhound's Fang's so good is because, like, it is solid weapon on most things in the game. In my opinion, this is a game, it's kind of like Dark Souls 2, where you probably shouldn't be playing this game with only... 
Maybe that's not a good idea with the great sword, dude. Look how much fucking damage that did. Um. What was I saying? Yeah, I, I, I think this is a game where you probably want to go through it with more than one weapon, but if you were to pick a weapon, I think Bloodhound's Fang is one of the better ones for sure. As, like for a casual player, especially, which is why I have it so high. But in terms of like weapons that I would want to use, in terms of weapons that I would want to use, it's not that high up, to be honest. Like, especially for no hit, it's like, I mean, there's no chance it's an S tier no hit weapon. It's probably at best a low A tier weapon for no hit, maybe less even. So, like you can put buffs on it, which is another reason why it's pretty decent, like bleed. And its base bleed buildup is, well, actually, I guess it's probably 45. Yeah, I don't like the curved greatsword moveset either. And, and the R2s are not so great, especially the follow-up. This is like just a trash move. Yeah, you know what? Wing of Estelle is not a good bingo weapon, dude. I, I'm convinced. With the, with the things that you need to kill... I don't know. I think part of the reason why Wing of Cell is so good is because it's magic damage, which you can buff up. But in bingo, you don't get an opportunity to do that, right? So let's go on Zio and Geo. And Matt's here as well. How's it going, Matt? There's a lot of Matt's, dude. Anyways, I'll probably end, I guess. I don't, I don't know what else to do, man. Um, Like this week, what's going to be this week, dude? Not sure. We might practice some more, I guess. Maybe. I need to, like, if we're going to actually win maybe, the maybe league, which I'm not sure if we will, obviously. Not ever. But if we're actually going to win, I, like, I can't be making mistakes like I made in this match, dude. There's no, there's no way. Uh, Nightmare Run, I finished the main bosses except for God's Can Duo, which I'll do eventually, but. Uh, but yeah, I think I'm going to end for today, guys. I'm probably just going to, like, chill out for the rest of the day and then, uh. I, I do have some stuff to do tomorrow, but I should be on maybe, like, maybe a bit later than normal. So. So, yeah, dude. Now I'm actually ending this time, <laughs> I guess. Unless there's something that I missed, but. But I, were both games, uh. Were both games 13 to 7 for us? Man, if, if that if that point differential how's it going, Brodo, by the way? If that point differential actually does matter eventually, then we're looking pretty damn good for that. <laughs> like if so far at least. And we're we're nearly halfway through the season, you guys. Believe it or not. It's gonna go by very quick, but yeah, let's write school. Somebody mentioned school earlier. I'm not sure if that's who we were writing anyways, but What's that of school, you guys? He is doing He's been doing some, like, really, uh, <laughs> really interesting runs lately. He's doing one HP, one stamina. Oh, in DS1. And you know what's interesting? In DS1, you actually need a certain amount of stamina to roll in that game. It's not like other Souls games where as long as you have one stamina, you can roll. This one, you can't even roll at all, dude. Wow, this looks fucking horrible. Yeah, go set a school, you guys. A legend. Uh, but yeah, I'll, I'll, I should hopefully be back on tomorrow, and uh, what are we going to do? I don't know, man. Like, it, it's kind of tough for me to go for, like, a, a serious no-hit run in, in the middle of, you know, like, an event like this, I think. So we might avoid cells. I Yeah, I still haven't gone back and finished that yet. Um, I don't know. We'll, we'll see tomorrow, but uh, have a good one, you guys. Thanks for hanging out. And if for people interested in bingo, two matches next week again. I don't know who we're against yet. You can go to the bingo roller site, but um, I think we played the Tom and Zoodle last. So I think that means we've got Aggie's team or uh, ADEF's team next. Or like Aggie, well, it's not Aggie's team, but Aggie CBD or um, ADEF and Chris. So, uh, but yeah, have a good one, you guys. I will see you all tomorrow.